I'm Bert Hurlbut, and right now we've been working about two and a half years on this hospital. The first year was just making a hole and getting the foundations in place. The second year was putting the structure in place. We finished the steel structure on this particular hospital. We're starting the jacking down process. We're sculpting it so that the pods are starting to look like they float into space. The real work is starting right now. One of the exciting parts of this side of the building is that the entire east side all the way down is going to be cantilevered. And what that means is there's going to be no support under the structure above. So to do that, we do something we call jacking down the building. What we've got right here is a specially designed column in which shim plates have been installed below the base plate. So there's a hole in the center of this big base plate and this jack is going to expand and it's going to push this part of the column up while pushing through the hole in the center and then they'll pull these shim plates out. Once they get them all out, then they'll slowly start releasing the pressure on the jacks and this will come down, down, down. All of a sudden, the strain is off and it's the building that's going to be holding uh, itself up. This column will no longer be used. The next operation then is going to be to remove this piece of steel. So the way they've been doing that is, you see behind me, there's a column that they've actually taken the uh, top, probably six feet of that column off. They've lowered that down. It's on the left side over here. You can see the chain fall that's got it in place. And then they're going to lift that column up, pull it out of the way, lower it down, move that operation up to this one. What we've done right now on the north tower behind me is we've jacked it down. The north tower, it's levels four through seven, which are look like they're just floating in air. Once we get the outside wall on, which is going to be all glass, it's going to be absolutely spectacular. When you go down to the basement, there's probably 100 to 200 tradesmen down there that are starting to put all the mechanical gear in place. All the studs, all the partitions are in place right now down the basement. All that work is just starting to come up through the hospital. We're going to start putting on the outside wall, we're going to get dried in, and we're going to start charging for the finish line. Once we get done, we're going to give the Palo Alto area one of the most spectacular hospitals, the most advanced hospitals ever. And we can start to see the end in sight right now. It's very, very exciting.